All right, everybody, welcome back to my my live stream. I know it may be dark right now. I'm really sorry, guys, but um, it's nighttime, as you can see, and this is like the best lighting I have so far. Uh, I don't have like a light source or anything. I can try turning on my closet light, but yeah, that's the best I can do. But yeah, let me move my phone here so you guys can see what I'm doing. And oh my gosh, uh, refill seconds. Oh, that was fast. Okay, so um, move my computer. Let me move that. So, sorry for you. Uh, can you see my whole drive? Yes, you can. Okay. So we left off with the our background. Now we're going to work on the, we are going to, oh man, I dropped my pencil. Hang on, if I can find it. Here it is. Oh, I dropped my pencil. Now I can use it. Okay, where was I? Okay, we're gonna be working on the, um, still in the background, but we already got the, the sky done. We're gonna get done with the um, woods. I mean, the forest trees. So this is what I'm gonna be working on. I'm gonna take this watercolor pencil. I'm not gonna add water to it, sorry guys, but I am going to do this. Oh my goodness, my computer's about to die. Um, I need to get this thing charged. Here, where's my charger at? There we go. Man, is that computer still there? Jeez. Okay, so where's the, my, uh, here it is, right in front of me. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to start with uh, this part right here because it's more lighter. So you want to start with the light one first. All right, let me see my little test coloring, everybody. Ooh. Um, what makes it more darker? Okay, we'll do that. I hope some people are watching. my blender good 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 okay so um, I'll use two colors for this gotcha okay so now I uh, I gotta work on this part Let's work on here. I'm going to work on this part first. Uh, 
All right. Once I get done with um, coloring these trees, I will be able to make them a little darker in the front and um, with a different uh, color pencil. Once I get done with the color pencil, I will be able to work on the mountains. I do apologize for leaving on my first live stream. I can't believe I got seven people watching. Hopefully I can have more people watching this time. On my live on this live stream. But I had to leave because we had dinner and uh, I was some family time, but now I'm back and um now I'm gonna be doing this drawing with you guys. Woohoo! Almost there. I'm almost there. Almost there. All right, let me switch pencils. Uh, where did that pencil go? Oh, here it is, right there. Duh. Okay. And boom. Almost there at the trees, baby. I'm so happy. Can't believe I'm almost done with this. This is just incredible. Just looking at all of this come to life, you know. Okay. Now I have to use this as a way to make this part a little lighter. Light, light, light. Light and now let's make this part lighter, lighter, and make this, still make this part darker. Okay, there we go. We have our differences right there. I'm going to look myself up on the live stream on my computer. So here I am. Uh, turn off the volume so that way. All right, there we go. I turn off the volume. I just want to see if anyone's on here. If anyone is um, going to say something on here or not. All right, so hopefully I get more subscribers from here. Okay, now we got to work on the forest part. That's going to be a little tricky. So let's work on doing this. Let's, color, let's over color the trees now with this dark pencil. Okay. So now Let's get these mountains working. All right, so the first part of the mountain, we're gonna do this. So, uh, let me see this. Ready? Let's do this. This might take a while, but you know what? It's patience that, that makes everything worth it. If you continue to be patient, then your drawing will look very, very excellent. So yeah, that's something that I have to keep reminding myself. There are times where I'm like, I just really want to get this over with, but I have to remind myself that Isaiah, if you want your drawing to look really good, take your time on it. Do not rush. You know, and it'll look okay.
All right. We've added some green here so far, but this is not the only green I have to be adding on here. I have to add a dark green in it once I get done coloring this. But I can't just color it like this, you know, and just leave it like that. I have to keep doing it uh, a few more times over and over again so that way the color will look more realistic. And uh, once it's realistic, we can switch on to a new color. And it takes time doing this, guys. Remember that. Take your time doing this. Hmm. Almost there. Um, let me see what else I have to do next. Okay, here we go. Hmm. Harlan has just... Oh, uh, I don't know what it says. Oh, well. I just got a text message from someone. I don't know what it is. All right. Let's move on with these colors now. All right, guys, you see how, how the color is changing now? It's no longer just that plain green that I was telling you about. You have to change your colors to make it more realistic. So I changed it from light green to dark green because I know that this part right here is going to be dark, but there's some parts that needs to be light here. Once I have the dark and light parts there, I'll be able to move to a lighter color green right here. And then I'll be done with the, the background. And then the only thing I have to do is the ship the logo here and the logo up here in the sun. I know it seems a lot guys, but I have to take my time and be very persistent on it. Mm. You know, whenever I'm doing drawings, I like listening to music just so I can get myself like in a good mood. Uh, it doesn't mean I'm not in a good mood right now. Trust me, I'm drawing and I like doing this and I have a passion for it. So I'm in a good mood already. It's just that Whenever I am like drawing and if I want to get myself like in like the rhythm of drawing, playing music really helps. It really does. The kind of music I listen to is, well, it's the list, it's the like a really oldie song. It's not like 50s old. That's not what I mean. I mean like 80s and 90s music. I mostly listen to that, those musics because that kind of music because I really enjoy it. I feel like it is um, something that I can get myself used to and it's something I can relate to. Even though I was never born in the 80s or the 90s, my parent, my dad was born in the 70s. I mean, he was born in 1970 something, I don't remember, but my mother was born in the 80s and um, they have been lived through all that, that time and that style. But I never did. But I feel like if I listen to that kind of music, it makes me think that I'm living in that moment, even though I'm not at all. So, yeah. I don't know why I'm looking at every time I end a conversation. And I do apologize if you hear my phone booming. I have a group chat on here with my friends. And I think they're talking about 
I don't know what they're talking about. I'm live streaming so with my phone, so I can't see what they're talking about. So, let me get this part. All right, so I got that part done, but do you see how I was able to change the colors there? Okay, so now we have to change our color a little bit, and that is not going to be, uh, it is going to be kind of daunting, but don't worry, I have a solution. Take the color that you used previously and color over this part. Do it very lightly, very, very lightly. Once you have it done very lightly, Take your lighter green and do this. And watch the magic work. All right, so you see how I was able to get this part lighter right here? That is how. Now, if you don't have that type of green color that is this, the best thing you could do is to um, use white to make it lighter. That's what I did before, and it still might make, be the same color. If it's not the same color, then I do apologize, but that is what I do. All right, let's continue on making this part a little lighter. Oh, I'm sorry, it still needs to be the same color. Whoops. Because we have to do the same thing that we did right here over here, so. All right, so let's get this green in here because it needs to be very accurate, very consistent with the way it should be working. Okay, now we have this. Okay. All right, now that I got that matching, let me get this part right here.
All right. Now we we'll use this color again. All right, so I have the lighter thing on here. Now I can see it's kind of going over the dark spot and that's not a good thing. So I'm gonna redo the dark part over here so that way it will blend in the right way like it should. Once it's blended in the right way and I messed up on purpose that way, you guys know how to fix this mistake on here. So here you go. Here's how you fix the mistake. You take your mark, you take your pencil that you used before and you color over the spot so that way it will be able to blend. Now, once this pencil blends in the right way, take your other pencil, which is your dark one, your dark green and do this to make it the way it should be. All right, then you get your blender. Blend the colors together, everybody. Blend the colors together. All right. So let's get this part. Okay, so now we have to work on the second part of this mountain. The second part will have to be here. This. Now the logo of my Star Wars is gonna be up here. I was gonna put it here, but I decided not to do that. So instead I'm gonna put it right here and it's gonna be like in marker, like black marker. So yeah. All right, 
Now we have to be careful when we're using this color. All right, folks. All right, we already have our light part there, so that means we're going to mix this part together. There we go. Look at how well that blended. Everybody, it blended the exact same way. All right. So we have that part light, we have that part light, we have this part lighted. Now, the next part we're gonna be using, oh my gosh, it looks so cool on my computer. I'm watching myself doing this on the computer and it looks really good. All right, so. Next part I'm going to be doing will be, here, let me send this to my, uh, I'm going to share this to my uh, Facebook, if there's a way for me to do that, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to do that. Sorry guys, my arm's in the way, whoops. I gotta go on my computer from this live stream to Facebook. I completely forgot to do that earlier. Oh, that was stupid. Why did I not do that? See, even artists make mistakes. All right, so here's what I'm gonna say. Um, continuing to draw Princess Lay. Oh, whoops. Okay, so. Uh, Oh, whoops, never mind. Oh, whoops. No, 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 no. There we go. Uh, is there a way to do it where I can... Here. I don't want to copy this. Okay, I think I know who I can send this to. It'd be easy to do, but I'm gonna have to do it. So that way, because I already sent it to Facebook, I gotta send this live stream video to something else, guys. So when, after I get done doing that, then I will be able to draw this with you guys again. So give me a minute. Hmm. Thank you for being patient with me. It really means a lot. Here. Mm. 
All right, got it. Okay, now I can do it. Okay, here I go. I'm gonna start drawing now. So where was I at? I mean coloring. I am going to continue to, oh, I gotta do, um, continue making it a little more lighter now this time. So that means I need to take this pencil and this pencil and mix them together. So that, and along with this. And then I have to mix this pencil and this pencil together to make it more lighter right here in the mountains. So here I go. Ready? Let's do this. So I'm not going to use my dark green this time. This is going to go here in the pan. Um, I actually thought I was going to use my green marker. Um, I might use my green marker for this part right here. I might. It depends. But yeah, it could depend. Cause, so that way if I want to have it smooth. But yeah, we'll see. But here I go. Make sure my sleeve is here, though, and my hand doesn't smear the picture because you got to be careful when you're you when you're coloring, especially with your hand right here, because your hand has oil in it. So when you're if you don't have anything to cover up your your um paper that you colored with, and you're going like this, the oil on your hand is going to smear your coloring, and it's just going to get ruined. So that's why I wear sleeved um I wear sleeve shirts whenever I'm coloring, or put a napkin over. The picture and I color so that way it does not get ruined at all just to let you guys be aware of that because it can get ruined very easily and um, yeah you do not want that to happen at all um, I remember that happened to me before like many times and I would get very frustrated and I found a solution to not doing that and I followed the solution and it worked and that was putting a napkin over it or wearing long sleeve shirts and I like wearing long sleeve shirts better because I get tired of getting napkins out so yeah I don't know why I keep saying so yeah 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 every time I finish the sentence but that's what I do I guess it's just me being myself it's really hard being it's really hard being yourself because you're afraid that other people will judge you for who you are, especially the way the world is today. But you just got to live with it, you know? That's what you have to do. All right, let's still go. You know what's so funny? Whenever I'm doing coloring and whenever I'm coloring with markers and pencils together, it looks great right here. But when you turn it around and see what happens here, just look at all the markers that bled through. I mean, it's crazy. But when you turn it back to this page, it looks really beautiful. But on the other side, you're like, ugh, like what happened? That's what I think is really funny about this. All right, so I think after I get done with the coloring, I'm gonna use this green marker and color over it, but I gotta be careful because I don't wanna go too much on it because I know the pencil will collect on here just like I collected on this marker. See this See this white stuff on here? That's all the pencil that collected from this right here, what I used to smooth out the picture. So I gotta be really careful when I'm doing that, but it does help smooth out the picture and make it more realistic. And those are Prisma mar markers. I'm using Prisma pencils. These are very expensive pencils. They are not cheap. I remember like one pack, like a 12 pack pencil cost me $34 just to buy because that's how like expensive and amazing those pencils are. But I started ask. I found like a quick way to save them. Um, just take care of them. And they last a lot longer too. Plus um, I got like, um, Three packs of them, the 12 pack one, the 24 pack one, and I think the 50, I think there was a 36 one. I'm not sure. But then there was a big, huge art kit that I had, like a Prisma art kit and plus Prisma pencils. Um, no, Prisma coloring uh, markers. So 
I'm not going to be buying any markers or pencils to store for a very long time. I used to have to do that, but not anymore since I have like this huge art kit from what I saved over the years. So I'm really grateful that I got these from my parents. You know, they didn't have to get these from me. I could have just bought them, but it just shows what type, how, how blessed I am to have parents that I do have right now. Because there's not a lot of parents who do this for their kids. Okay, I overcolored that. I shouldn't have done that. So let me fix this. Okay. All right, so um, we still keep continuing right here, but we have to make sure this part is okay. So that way this does not go over because I remember I didn't check it to see if it was okay and I colored through it and went over it and it was a mess. Like I I did not like that. So I, it's better to be safe than sorry. And you know that. Well, that's what my teacher told me. My Thunder, my teacher Thunder Burton tells me that and I, I, I say it now because I know what he means by that. Better to be safe than sorry. Mm. Mm. I remember I had a conversation with Mr. Burton. Um, and I was talking about multitasking because I was trying that at school to see if it work. It did not work out for me that well. I was terrible at it. And I'm like, man, my mom, because I saw my mom doing it really well. And I told him I was trying to do it like my mom did. And then he's like, well, women are a lot better at multitasking than um, men are. You know, men are not that really good at it. And I can see what he means by that. I don't know why it's that way, but that's just the way it is. I cannot believe I'm switching this paper. I'm terribly sorry, guys, but this is the only way I'm able to get this the right way. Oh. Okay, now I gotta switch the other way around. There we go. Mm. All right, now we use this color. Woohoo! That sounds so lame right now. Okay, let's do this. All right, see how it's lighter now on this side? That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get it to go lighter right here. So let's do that. Hmm. I've never done backgrounds like this before. This is like a total background I made up on my own. It's just, my teacher always tells me to um, to do art, art, to challenge myself in art that I've never done before. Because um, when you get, he says that um, when you get into like college art, you know, it's gonna be very tough to do. So my, you might wanna challenge yourself now so that way when you get into college art, 
you know, you can, you'll already be used to doing harder stuff. So, yeah. All right. All right, and let me get my lighter color. Let's use the Actually, you know what? I know how to use it. Instead of doing that, we'll just do it this way. I'll put the lighter colors where they're sh where they should be at already. All right, but as soon as we get right here, that's when the whole thing needs to start to change right here. This, this, this. All right, here I go. Okay, we are getting there. I'm so happy about this progress. And I'm really happy doing this live stream because you guys can see how I was able to progress with the trees. You guys see how I was able to blend with the mountains. And now you guys are going to be able to say I do the logo. And I keep the sun like bright. Um, yeah. And uh, what was another thing I like doing? Oh, yeah. Here's another thing. I also want to make the logo up, up here, so that way, the Star Wars logo, so that way um, it won't get messed up. <laughs> but I'm very excited. I can't believe I'm almost done with this coloring. This is so awesome. Ooh. <laughs> I think the next live video I'll be doing will be the digital art. That one will be very interesting to watch because you guys will be like, whoa, he does digital art? Like, how is he doing this on his phone? Yeah, I do digital art on my phone, guys. Okay. So. Ah. Oh, I didn't mess up on this part. Okay. That scared me. Oh. These parts always scared me sometimes. Oh, I don't like this scaring me, but I, uh. You know, get over that fear, Isaiah. You can do this. <laughs> All right. 
light color now. Well, let's keep it this light. That way you guys can see it clearly. We can see clearly now the rain has fall. Okay, I, I'm a terrible singer. You don't want to hear me sing. Nope. Sweet Caroline, ba ba ba. <laughs> One more, I got it. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. All right. I think that is all right. Now we do the lighter colors. Here we go. I was going to put buildings on here, but instead I decided to put nature because Princess Leia, you know, she's the type of character that, um, that always symbolizes hope in Star Wars. And nature is kind of like the symbolization of hope. And I just thought that her and nature going together, plus the X-Wing right there, it's, it makes everything look really unique. And it shows who she really is. So that's why I decided to put a nature background on here. I really need to get like a pencil sharpener for my bedroom. <laughs> I always use the one at the school and the one at my mom's house. All right, now let's get this part in here. Get this lighter so that way it matches the ground. Get this part light and leave it, all right. Get this part fixed. And there we are. Pretty cool, huh? Now let me get my blender because I'm going to blend this together. All right, now we need to work on the lighter parts. Let's work on this part right here.
All right, mountains are um almost to a close, everyone. Or should I say ladies and gentlemen. And I've been live streaming for 51 minutes, almost an hour, and I'm almost up the mountains. You guys see how well I progressed on here. I started with the trees. Well, in my first video, I started with the background. I then with the background of the sun, the sky. Now I'm working with the trees. Then I started working on the mountains. I'm nearly done with the mountains. Now I got to work on the... Um, after that, I'm going to work on the symbol right here. And then once I get done with the symbol, I'm going to erase the this part right here. Work on the X-Wing, the color of it. It's still going to be a green X-Wing, but it'll be, it'll have, you'll see the, um, the, the sophistications on there. But I am going to put pen on the X-Wing. I'm not going to, but I'm not going to make it darker with marker because that's a little bit of a risk. So I'm going to use pen on there just to get myself out of my comfort zone and do more um, challenging art techniques on here. But that's the best I'm going to do. So I gotta find my pen because I know I had it with me. No, oh, it's on my bed right here. I was using it earlier today to make a list, but now I uh here's my pen. <laughs> I'll use that on the X-Wing. Alright, so Let's do this. All right, now let's mix the watercolor in here. Okay, next. All right, now I uh, am still gonna use this dark part. All right, one more mountain to do, guys. I'm really happy about this one. This time, I'm going to let me see if I can use this one. It's a little darker here. All right. Now I am going to use this part. Use it very lightly though, that this is the lightest part of the mountain.
Got it. All right. There we go. And the mountains are complete, everyone. Ooh, hang on. A little bit of blending, but other than that, they are complete. I am so happy that they're complete. My goodness. <laughs> that is crazy. They... Look, this looks amazing. It looks very beautiful. I love the scenery. It looks fantastic. All right, now, um, oh, how did I miss this? Hang on a minute. Is that it? There we go. Now I can use um, my pen to do this. All right, this is going to be a bit of a challenge, but I love challenges, so let's get out of the comfort zone. Let's do this. Now, you all know that pen cannot be erased, so be very careful when you're using the pen, guys, like I am. I used to be scared of using pen. Just because I know how to use it well right now does not mean I am not scared of using it today. I It can be pretty really daunting. So be very careful when you're using it. Mm, I, I love the scenery. It looks so beautiful. My goodness. All right, I've been live streaming for an hour and 22 seconds so far. Okay. All right, just follow the lines and you'll get right on it. All right, I might not be talking right now, but it's because I'm trying so hard to concentrate on this.
Got it. All right, now people will be able to see that very clearly with the pen on there. So uh, I'm sorry if you guys see a big shadow, but I'm really trying to see what I'm doing. So I'm just lowering my head here. All right, sorry if I'm being very quiet, guys. I'm just trying so, so hard to concentrate. Gotcha. Oh my. Oh, I'm almost done. I have to do the little, little the little two wheels there. I might do the um the X wing last so that way I can have the um pen there for a little bit. But I really want to get the hope part colored in. So, oh, let's do that. Oh, but I really like the scenery. I love the trees I put in there. I love the mountains I put in the background. And I love the X-Wing. I love the sun. I like the little symbol I put on the sun, the little hope. And I can't wait to make the Star Wars um, initials on there. So, yeah, let me, I'm gonna look up some Star Wars initials real quick so that way, once it's on there, I'll be able to, um, once it's on there, I'll be able to um, line it up the way I want it to be. Here it is. This is how I want it. Oh wait, no, 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 not that photo. This one. There we go. I found it. Okay, that's how I want it. All right, now I gotta do the last one. The last wheel here.
Right. Let me get um, this fixed. There we go. All right, so the X-Wing is on there the way I want it to be. It's lined up perfectly. Now I'm gonna do Hope. So here I go. Be very light on it because I will be adding white to it since it's in the sun. All right. There we go. Now I can finally use um, white. I can use my long white now since it's not that much. But yes, okay. This is looking really well. I love the way the symbol is. I love the way the letters are placed out on here. And I also love the way um, Hope is stand out on there. The way the letters Hope is. I think I already said it twice. I like how Leia is right there in the middle, like right there at the side, and the background just represents her. You know, it's really cool. Obviously, the background in the photo I printed out is not this one, but I did make it my own, so that way it could be my own art that I have, so. Yeah. How long have we been live streaming? One hour and 10 minutes, dang. Let me uh, get this little wing here, this rebel symbol. Hey, and the symbol, the rebel symbol does represent hope. So that is pretty unique right there. No, okay, I wouldn't say pretty. I'd say it's very unique since, you know, that's what the rebellion is about. They're all about hope. And oh my goodness, it's one hour and 11 minutes now. One eleven, baby. Oh yeah. Things are going good right now. And it is 10, 10 p.m. All right, now let's do this. All right, let me erase this part. Here I go. Now I gotta be very careful when I'm doing this, so you guys ready? Because, ooh. Here I go.
Okay. Let's do this. A beacon of hope, everyone. That's what she is. Princess Leia is the beacon of hope, which is why I am outlining the outside of the words on here. I really hope I don't run out of this green because it's the only thing that's actually helping me right now. All right. All right, is there anything else I have to use besides this? Let me see if there's another um, pencil I can use to help me make this more lighter. Uh, what kind of yellow is this? This is a, this is a lighter yellow. This is a lemon yellow. I can use this. I can use this and add white to it. All right, so this is what I'll do. Color it extremely lightly. I can't see that. Man, it's very light. All right. Let's try it this way. Okay, I can do it this way. Hold me right there. I don't know what that was. Um, but yeah. Color this extremely lightly. I do apologize that my uh, phone is doing that. Once again, my group chat with my friends is the one that's um, that are texting with each other. I'm not texting with them since my phone is like recording me. Speaking. And now I'm gonna use white. <laughs> okay, so that helped me. Now I can uh, use this color. I gotta smear this white off of here. I mean, smear the green off of the white pencil. Uh, I can use this, so here I go. Here we go. I really need to get a pencil sharpener. I'm almost there.
There we have it. Oh my goodness. We did it. Yay, I'm so happy. All right, so now I got to do the X-Wing, everybody. So I think I know how I'm going to do this. This is going to be pretty, pretty cool. Let me get a dark, um, a little bit of a dark green right here. Uh, Here we go. All right, now uh, one hour and 21 minutes. Oh my goodness, that long? All right, so it's 1020 right now. The only thing I have to do next will be, what's the next thing I have to do? I have to remember. Uh, oh, I know now. I gotta make this part. Where is that mark? Oh, here it is. Now I'm using apple green. There we go. Now let's mix it with this color. All right. 
Good, 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 good. The next thing we want to use is this color. And we're going to use this, we need to color this part black. Okay, right, so. Now I can use dark green. Dark green will be used in this in between. Do not go over the white. Be very careful when you're doing this. All right, ready? All right, everybody, almost there. Got to make some more lines on here. You're wondering why I'm not talking that much because these are really small areas. And when I'm doing small areas, I really, really try so hard to focus on them. So there we go. All right. Now, uh, let's get my... no, I'll just leave it like that. Okay. Now I got to make the Star Wars logo. It's an hour and 27 minutes, almost 30. So, uh, where is um, that pencil that I have? I think this is it, is it? Let's see, yeah. Let me get my Star Wars logo on here so that way I know what I'm doing. All right, so, uh, where's a ruler when I need one? Oh, here it is. Yep, you gotta use rulers when you're coloring, guys. Always use rulers. Always, always, always use rulers. Can I find one? Uh, where is my ruler at? Where is it at? Uh, hang on. Mm, here it is. Ooh, my ruler. Looks very, very amazing. Sorry guys, I was blowing away all that little crumbs I had. Alright, so now, let's make a line here. Let's see how long I want this. I want it to be right here, so. Do this. 
Alright, sorry guys, so I have it this way. It's just that it's the only way for me to make this work. Okay, so... Star. And we got wars. All right, now let's line them up. Okay, now let's get this one part in here. Oh, and I got star in here. So, yes. I'll be able to fill those words in with marker, but other than that, I got it. All right, that's as far as I've gotten on the words so far. 
Uh, and oh, hang on a minute. I know what to do. Okay, I fixed that problem. I can't erase it, but I can go over it and fix it. And there we go. I went over it and I fixed it. <laughs> awesome. Oh my gosh, I messed up on the R. Whoops. All right, there we go. And... All right, here we go. Time to connect these letters together. This won't be easy, but it is my specialty. Got it. Okay, now I have to color this in with marker. So I wish I had my paintbrush marker but I don't. So, um, actually, I do know what I can use. I might have my paintbrush marker. It just might be in here somewhere. Let me see. It. Well, it should be in here somewhere. And I, I don't know where it is. Crud, it's not in here. I really thought I had it. Hmm, maybe it's in this pocket in my book bag, but oh, it's not anywhere in my book bag at all. Here, I'll look for it later. Uh, maybe I have another set I can use. Uh, let me see. Mm, not that one. Nope. Man, I can't believe I lost it. Mm, here it is. Well, it's not the paintbrush one, but it's a marker that has, that's like a pen. I can use that to my advantage. So, yeah. I've been doing this an hour and 37, no, 38 minutes now. So let me color the same. All right, here we go.
It's almost there. Actually, hang on a minute. I can use this. Yeah. Put this marker in here. Ah, it's not working. Oh, it's a paintbrush kind, but it's a bigger one, so. This is going to be extremely wet, so I have to make sure I keep this dry. And this is the paintbrush version of the marker. I was telling you about, there was a tiny one, though. A tiny paintbrush marker I had. I must have left it at school when I was working on this. But, yeah. Well, here's an, a, a lesson for me. Never leave anything in your locker that you need for art. Especially if you're doing this late at night around 12 o'clock in the morning or early when you wake up in the morning at 6 o'clock in the morning. Alright. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, dang it. I messed up. Oh, oh wait, no, I didn't. Good. I thought I did. That would have been really bad. All right. Hmm. All right, now I gotta do it this way, upside down. Sorry guys, <laughs> upside down, here we go. All right. No, man, I hate that this per this paper is curved. Uh, I gotta fix that. All right, I fixed it. Man, I gotta be more careful with this paper.
All right, there we go. I fixed that. Um, I'll let it dry once I get done painting this little thing. But yeah, once it's done drying, I'll color the marker over. I'll color black marker over it again, just so it'll be all right. All right, sorry guys if I sounded really frustrated earlier. It's just whenever I mess up on a drawing I work real hard on it, it, I'll react in the way where I'm like, oh man, I worked real hard on this. And now it's like ruined and I'll get really upset about it. And yeah. All right, that's not the best coloring marker on there, but it's what I could do. Mm-hmm. All right, now let me see how this works. This, um, this blending right here, let me see. You know what? I'm not going to put marker on there because it's already the way it's supposed to be. But I am going to put some pen on it. Definitely going to do that. So let me put pen around the trees so that way there's no mistake around it. All right, I gotta wait for the marker to dry. But other than that, guys, uh huh, yeah, I completed the drawing. Oh, uh, the coloring too tonight. So I'm really excited. All right, I'm gonna be ending this live stream video right now. If you guys want to see more drawing videos, if you guys want to see more reaction videos, or even some new live stream videos that might be coming very soon. Um, please make sure to like and subscribe to this channel, okay? I really want to get connect with all of you audiences, and I will see you all next time. Isaiah Pope, the artist.